If there's one thing the vast majority of Tesla owners can agree on, it's that the piano black finish of the center console has got to go. Personally, I like the way it looks when it's clean, but it gets dirty really fast. It's a fingerprint magnet, it attracts dust, and then it starts looking like crap. Plus, it's very easily scratched, which I recently found out by getting this nice deep scratch in it by total accident, and now I'm upset I didn't cover it up before. To be perfectly honest, the main reason I haven't covered it up yet is because I was like, I have to get a vinyl sticker, put it on there perfectly, and with my track record, I know it's gonna drive me nuts trying to get it perfect. It's gonna be misaligned and look worse than it does right now, so I was like, I'll just leave it. But after that scratch, I feel like I have to at least try. So right here in this box from Top Fit, we have some carbon fiber covers to put over all of the center console to make it look a lot nicer and also protect it from getting scratches. Box is very simple, who cares? We don't need the box, but on the inside, nice, we got that carbon fiber action. Yo, wait, hold on. This isn't what I thought. I was expecting this to be, you know, those vinyl stickers that you put on. This is actually a hard chunk of plastic. It's actually a whole, ch like, look at this. It's a hard piece. So this looks like it might actually be easier to put on than the vinyl sticker I was expecting. Down on the bottom we have 3M adhesive going all around it to keep it in place, but it's not on the whole entire thing, so hopefully it'll stay on there enough. So we got this one piece right here for the top, the second piece here for the cup holders, and then this other part for the middle. These are on the thicker side, it's like a big chunk of plastic, and look at that, it looks super nice. But if you take a look at this, it's on the thicker side, so I'm not sure if it's going to be getting in the way of opening and closing the center console, because it is thick. It's not a thin sticker. So I'm not too scared to install it, so we're going to get the center console cleaned up nice and then stick this on and see how it goes. It should definitely be easier than installing a sticker, that's for sure. Alright, so I think I got it as clean as it's going to get. I'm not going to go crazy trying to get it super clean, because it's going to get covered up anyway, so no one will know. But I'll know. Will I though? I'll probably forget. No, I won't. Ooh! Oh, well, it looks clean to me. Whatever. We just gotta peel off the backing of the adhesive. Simple. Once all the adhesive is off, we're ready to go. Let's see if we can get this lined up perfectly and attach securely. Okay, I think we have it lined up perfectly. It's opening. So now we'll just apply some pressure, get it nice and secured around all the edges. Oh, wow, that actually looks super nice. So obviously, since we can open it up, we have it on there right, otherwise it'd be hitting this piece up here. So we actually got it aligned pretty perfectly. Nice. It did help out to open it up and do it, that way we can align it to the edges. No, definitely not bad. Just gotta make sure it's on there. And if you want to remove it later, it should be easy to just pull right off without making any damage. Now we'll move on to the second piece right here. Alright, looks like we got it aligned, it's opening up just fine. I'll just apply some pressure along the edges, get it nice and secured. Oh wow, this is so much different, it's matte and it just, like look at this, no fingerprints. I wish I did this sooner. And now we have the last piece around the cup holders. Oh, it's going to look super clean. And here we go. Alright, let's just apply some pressure, get it nice and secured. And just like that, we are done. That was a very simple process. We can close this, open it up, still works fine. We can open up this, works. Open up this, it works. Wow, that's nice. Now remember, this is a chunk of plastic that's different than the vinyl stickers that would wrap around, so it's really only on the top, which I don't mind. And I even feel like this is a lot better for protection because it's actually a hard piece of plastic on top instead of just a very thin sticker. So if something falls and drops on this, the plastic should break, maybe, and then it should protect the actual center console, which is great. It feels so smooth, it looks so nice. Wow, I am so impressed with this. It looks so much better. I can't believe I waited this long to do it. Mm, mm, mm. It just changes everything. Like, it's seriously no fingerprints. Like, I'm just rubbing my fingers on it. It's just super smooth and nothing is sticking to it. It looks so much better. Can't believe I waited this long. Although, if I didn't wait this long, I probably would have ended up with the vinyl stickers and they'd be peeling and on crooked and everything. This actually looks nice, perfect fit. I'm very impressed. I definitely recommend these if you want something that's a bit more protective than the vinyl stickers and easier to apply because it's a chunk of plastic that you just have to line up. It's not a sticker you have to try to get the bubbles out, wrap it around the edges and do all that stuff. That would drive me nuts. You should definitely get this if you want to protect the center console. I mean, it looks so nice. Wow, just looking at this. It's like I got a new car now. 
It's that good.